Uh, that's why I try to like stay the fuck away. You know what I mean? Oh fuck that, dude! Bro, you could have like fifty doing some shit, and the motherfucker comes through and do some dumb shit, bro. Yeah. Hey, funny, bro. funny, suck my dick type shit, bro. Yo, real quick, somebody just called me on the phone, and he was like, he tweeted that because somebody from CG called me. I called him, and he said, "Yo, you know how CG says sell for six or some shit?" And then he says, "Lang Buddha sells for seven and they hung up or some shit. Wait, what? I don't, I don't know. I, hold on, he called me back. OG peanut, OG peanut. We'll Sorry about that. I had a major, I had a major fucking headache. <laughs> Every job was kind of fucked, so that's probably why you don't see it. Yeah, I woke up with like three extra gun parts in my pocket. What the fuck? Oh, this this miss. guy, this guy just called me to tell me that Buddha buys for seven per. Like, <laughs> yeah, that's nothing new. I, I know, I know it's not. You took care of it, OG. Oh, he said anybody. <laughs> he said anybody from CG. He didn't say no triple OG from CG. Call me. Yo, he said anybody for taking that call, OG man. Yeah, he Thanks. said anybody. He said you, anybody, Vinny. Okay. Not. not my fault. You may call him. I, so... I didn't even look at Twatter. Yeah, I mean, we were in a meeting where we we're more worried about the meeting than worrying about Twatter. So, so I accepted. Yeah. I accepted. You, the, no, I accepted people, the call. You, I accepted the call was the key was telling you the story that I already know. So what is the point of me? You know what I'm saying? Because we're all together having a, a meeting, that's why. But we okay. get it. You're no, OG, no, so you're no, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, Vinny, listen. No, when, when the OG, OG needs I'm to sorry, do man. something, he needs to do something, all right? That's yeah, understandable. Oh, Triple OG, I'm sorry, I'm man. I'm only trolling, by the way. I'm only busting your balls. I, I just told you what happened yesterday. Thank you. So, you wanted to speak, right? Did anything happen? Like, you or not? Uh, yeah. So, that dude from yesterday, Donnie, I got someone trying to scoop him up and get that SIM card. Now, the reason I want someone else to do it is that this guy, I don't want him to, like, pull his SIM card, get rid of it type shit, because I'm pretty sure this dude working for someone else. Why are you, you in know my what I mean? asshole? And this so I'm thinking two things. One is if he got a clean SIM card, that say something. If his SIM card not clean, well, it's going to get some dirt on it. You know what Wait, I mean? What happened with this guy, Donnie? Oh, yeah, Vinny wasn't around for that, so we're going to have to explain it to him, but... I got oh, a boy. call from this guy named Donnie. I know this guy, guy like, from uh, the sewers and shit like that. And he's okay. like, calls me up, and he's like, yo, dude, I'm looking for some people who want to do an ammunition. And I'm like, I think Rami's already over shit, dude, that's I'm like not free over guns it. and fuck, shit like that. Fuck Donnie on my So dick. I call up Rami. I'm like, yo, you want to do this? He's like, I. Right. So we throw some people on the uh, on his app. Mm -hmm. Um, We go do this shit. Or when I say we, I mean... Um, him, Val, Peanut, uh, Chris, I, were you there? Maybe Rami, whatever. Yeah, so we do the day. Dude. And then a bunch of shit go down and it sounded like he tried to in run away way. with the shit. In the middle of the street. Okay. I wasn't there, so I can't really go off of like, like, is this, was this guy trying to steal the shit? Not was he not doing, trying to steal the shit? You know what I mean? I'm getting shit. like mixed messages, exaggeration. Well, Peter, you were there? What, 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 what happened? What went on? Well, let, well, let me, let me finish up. Yeah, so, tell the story. Where, so where it kind of landed was we went to go interrogate this guy over in the prison. Mm -hmm. And the thing that stood out to me most than anything is that when I initially got the phone call, right, from Rami, mm -hmm. he was like, yo, I think this guy scam us. And obviously in my head, I'm like, why would someone commit suicide? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it doesn't make any sense. I know where his thing is. I know who, like, what he does. Like, you might as well just come over here and be like, yo, kill me forever type shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I get this. I'm, like, skeptical. So I call the dude. The phone is disconnected. I call him again three minutes later. Phone is disconnected. Now when we over and interrogating his ass over in prison, he goes... He was on the phone with Harry Brown about lockpicks or repairing his vehicle. Now, let me ask you something. If you got a motherfucking weapon crate and you got cops on your ass, why would you be doing a lockpick or a like a repair deal? You know what I mean? Okay. My whole spiel is I want to go pick up this guy's SIM card, see what's up. Oh, hold on. You missed it, Tuggy. Was you there when uh, yeah. Harry showed up? You, you wasn't there, right? No. Okay, so Harry showed up after Rami called him, and yeah. I, I don't know if he, I don't know what was going on because Harry was uh, acting fucking stupid. But Harry basically admitted that the dude called him to to give him the shit or, so, or to like he called him to give him the shit so he could craft it for him or something. Like he was doing a deal 
with Harry. Wait, what? I'm, yeah, about the gun parts or some shit like, some shit like nah. that. I forgot word for word what it was. Now, he yeah. told Rami, and then he wouldn't tell us for some odd reason in front of him. No, but he, no, but what did he tell Rami over the phone? Remember what, how he, uh... yeah, he said, Rami said that he said that he called him and said that he wanted him to make the guns for him with the fucking BP or some dumb shit like that. Yeah, so he was making a deal with Harry Brown while, while he was opening the crate and shit. So he was oh, on some snake wait, shit. Wait, what? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, so he was on some snake shit 100%. He was lying the whole time. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't break though. He literally died on his hill. Hey, the Carmine. question, the question what I'm the confused fuck? about is how did he, how'd you make him get away with this stuff when you were all together doing this oh, yeah. gun crate? Yo, we forgot the, okay, so the part is, is that it was his crate, so he was doing the hack yeah. to like get the shit. Soon as he opened the crate and like did the hack, cops showed up. Soon as like, oh, a bunch of cops, okay. as soon cops as showed yeah, up. Okay. a few cops. So it was few, uh, uh, as soon as cops showed up, he grabbed the shit, and everybody went separate ways and like ran from the cops. But the cops mm -hmm. chased him. He lost them, and then that's when he went to the white garage. Uh, he put the crate down, collected the shit, and called Harry. And then we was trying to help him and see what was going on, but he wouldn't uh, answer our calls. And basically just dipped out uh, he like snaked us damn okay so i mean i mean why the fuck did this guy do like the, like tug said like he signed this death warrant but he literally wait i'm so confused he calls tugs and asks him if he has people for him to do the, yeah, this weapon crate, but then he tries scamming yeah, so, so that, I, I think that, that makes doesn't no make sense. any sense bro i know where all his computers are I know what he does 24-7. Blades, thank you for the 500 bits, brother. I appreciate that. Like, is he trying to... Like, are you get what I'm saying? Like, this guy mm -hmm. does moonshine all the time. In this room. I make one phone call. This guy ain't going to be able to do moonshine anymore. Well, he, I plant went, one thing on his thing that rip his entire, like, butt coin operation. You know so what I mean? Are, are we 100% on this? Like, that he was not scamming? A not 100 million percent, but we pretty sure, yeah. We pretty sure. I, I think we're overcooking it though. Like, l listen, the guy paid for everything, wanted you guys to run it for him, then decided that he didn't really fuck with us. I mean, I could tell you what the scam was. It. I could tell you what the scam. The, the scam is very simple. He's just he needed people to use. That's it. Yeah, and he then needed, just flip it back to somebody else. He needed to use that shit. Like he he wanted to use us to help him with the crate and to even because so uh, Vinny, he, he what, needed, what is this blueprint thing? Can you, what, what is that? Blueprints to make guns. One. You got yeah, blueprints you for one. extended mags. Blueprints for lasers. You have blueprints for everything to make it's random on though. The, the gun. Yeah, yeah, Vinny, but it's just random what you get in the crate. Vin, basically, he needed people to start the job. You get what I'm saying? So we bought chips so we could help him do the job, and the plan was that we was gonna split that shit. Because we was helping him do the job, and without us, he wouldn't have been able to do it. So that's yeah, that's where the scam what, part comes in. Like you know I think what Vinny's saying is like this is kind of with the wavelength I was on yesterday. And like, why would you ruin your entire life over like mm. a handful of guns? Exactly. You know what I mean? I don't know because the guy's a fucking idiot. Who knows? Well, I mean, this is like next level, like. Like, like, wait, he went to like the level insane. of we, you had to get HQ chips, you had to add people onto his mm -hmm. HQ. Well, he owes us money, doesn't he? The yeah, whole he owes thing us like money. that just to just to fuck you guys over. So he's working for Lang basically because Harry and Lang are very close. Wait, so, Lang? Uh, See, Harry, I didn't know who Harry Guy was. Harry and Lang are very close. They're, they're just together every day. They did the whole sanitation union and everything. Well, I don't, well, I don't know if this dude, Ryan, I don't know if this dude is working for Lang, but. I do know that. Well, I got an entire list. So I'm going to tell you right now. And this is what, like, so we did a laundromat. We end up picking this lady. Uh, She go by the name Dee Dee. And uh, I know she robbed shit because, like, she was, like, trolling about, like, how easy hacks are and shit like that. And whatever, like, I didn't really, whatever. So, we, you know, we went to check her for weapons, and I saw a notebook. And I'll tell you right now, anytime I see a notebook, I'm looking at that shit. Mm -hmm. And I opened this notebook up and I forgot what the fuck it said. It said like, it was like a list of what people owed money for. Like, like, like they were selling drugs or some shit. Mm -hmm. It had like 15 names, a bunch of numbers on it. And Donnie's number said like $45,000. And so... I didn't like really press it too much because I'm like, listen, we ain't got no like real beef with these guys, whatever. So I'm just going to play around with it. So I've been like fucking with Donnie on it and shit like that. And he acting really sus around the names. And so all I'm trying to say is like, if this shit is real, bro, that name is that, that list of names, bro. I'm just saying, bro, there's a way to get that money back.
Mm. It was like half a million dollars worth so of you shit said on there. He has a quarter with, million. He has ties with Harry Brown. So from my viewpoint, from an outside viewpoint, the way it looks, bro, I cause you know the beef that Lang and Mr. K's had for a hot minute, right? Oh wait, hold up, hold up. Wait, what? did you hear that? Or am I tripping? Was, was there a girl or something? Who the fuck got us up? Probably somebody it's probably, it's probably Craig yeah. in our car. Mm, some, I think so, someone's so, so the, the way I'm looking at it is if Harry Brown has ties with this guy Donnie, and knowing like Lang has beef with Kay with this whole sanitation thing, bro, there's a world I believe that like Tugs, he he's maybe trying to maybe like maybe Lang told this guy Donnie to do this to like prove himself to him. You know, in a in a, in a world where you're like okay, yeah, you know Tugs, alright, call Tugs. See if you get this lined up, get the boys, and then fucking scam them. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you know, it, that could be possible. Like, because of the beef that him and Mr. K had. But then, but why would Harry be honest then? You know what I mean? Yeah, that is true. Harry he's, was. He's I mean, he fucking. Harry weird, was though. on some weird shit. He was. <laughs> he was acting Harry honest, and then he said he was lying. Anyone under the bus? Like that. Harry will not. Harry will tell you to do something and throw you under the bus for doing it. That's, wait, so he would admit it? Yeah, wasn't yeah. Harry like your dad back would. in the day? Harry will tell you to do something and then throw you under the bus for doing it just because he can. If, if there's one thing I know, that guy will survive through anything. If there are so you think he was warfare, the truth? He will live. Yeah. Oh, yeah, a long time ago. Harry I will him not, and this guy up with Harry fucking uh, Dimitri with, with C4 multiple times. Yeah, I remember that. Wait, Harry so am Harry I understanding you? Right? Am I understanding you, Zakir, that, that maybe it was for Lang, but the only reason uh, Harry be honest it's because that's the kind of shit he do type shit, just to save his own ass. To clear his name? Well, yeah, yeah. But I don't know. I don't know if it would be for Lang. Fuck knows. I don't know what them he, two, uh, how those two's relationship is. But uh, all I know is Harry will die on a hill. Like, if he, if he said this son, he, he doesn't lie. Harry don't lie. He lies, but, like, he would be a white lie. He wouldn't lie over something like that. He was that's trying to make it very clear when he was there, too. This is between you and Rami. And yeah, wouldn't want to speak any yeah. further. He won't get involved. Like, well, what did Harry gonna admit cause conflict to? For him, he'll just like be he like, said, yeah. Harry said that the dude caught him and basically wanted Harry to grab the gun parts and craft it for him and basically give it to Harry. Uh. Instead of spending that shit with us. Now, did the guy have any... Okay, so quick question, because I know Rami was there, right? We all know how Rami is. Rami, Rami will try to get a lick at any time possible. Is there a world where Rami... It, was Rami like making this guy sus at all? No, here's the thing, right? Here's why I will defend Rami on this. I will defend Rami on this. Rami was gonna split it with him regardless. If Rami was gonna mm -hmm. rob it, he would have done it, right? Rami asked. He said, "No, you keep the you keep all the gun parts. We'll keep the blueprint." The guy said, "No, I want the blueprint." And he said, "All right, then after this is done, we'll work something out." All right? I think here's what happened. Here's my theory on this. This guy got scared. He got spooked. He got scared, and he okay. he he didn't want a snake. I believe that his intentions wasn't to keep all of the stuff. Could you speak louder? Gonna... Uh, I don't want to yell because they can hear us. I would have over oh, there. Come over here. Come closer to me. I, I believe that the guy didn't want a snake. He was going to give us something. But he definitely wasn't going to give us a blueprint if it was in there. He got worried because Rami, he knew that Rami wanted the blueprint. We tried to do some rat shit to get, you know, if there was a blueprint. He'd be like, no, nah, there was no blueprint. I got away from the cops. I opened the crate. Here's, here's your half type shit. You get what I'm saying? Uh-huh. And then he was going to go about it that way. I think that's what happened to him. He, he, I think he got scared. So do you think he generally got oh scared because God, it was dude. four of y'all and only two of them? And he thought... even two of them. It weren't two of them. That, that Val didn't even know who he was. It was just him. Okay. Yeah, so, possibly, but... So, uh, so, so is there a world that, like, he got scared because, like, the conversation Rami and this guy Donnie had tripped out the guy so bad that he thought he was going to yeah, lose Rami the whole didn't, crate? Ra I'll defend Rami on this. Rami didn't say it, like, aggressively. Rami didn't say nothing like this. He just... Rami just said it like, yo, we want the blueprint, you know? Yeah, he probably know was Rami, scared, okay, but... Okay, hold on. When I know Rami really wants something, he'll literally re repeat himself to the person a thousand fucking times. I was there, he didn't. Okay. That, because I know Rami, Rami be like, yo, so, yo, you know, you, you know, like, if there's a blueprint there, like, I know it's yours, but, you know, like, we'll, we'll talk about it. And then, like, he'll come at him again and say the same thing over and over, because that's how you know Rami really wants something. So that that that, that could have tripped out the guy, too, you know what I'm saying, if that happened. Also, that being was on kinda radios the... around him. But well, that's the angle that I was coming from. It's like, for me, I was like, why would this guy... I want you to put this in a perspective, right? The guy doesn't have anyone on HQ app. Dude's got buck coin enough to get a contract. Uh -huh. He's searching for people to help. He agrees that he's going to split this crate. 
and now he committing suicide by like taking the shit. I was like, yo, did we suss him out or something like that? But what I was told yesterday is that we were possibly trying to get the shit, but he didn't hear that conversation. Mm -hmm. I mean, you to be real, I mean? if I'm looking at a bunch of people on the radios and I'm already like sus, like I'm, I'm yeah, going like, to He didn't, he didn't look at us on radios. We were on roofs. Mm -hmm. he, was, I mean, he was stood by the crate the whole time. Listen, the, dude, the dude was definitely scared, but he, he did he did do some sneaky shit. Okay, because yeah. uh, that dude's a piece so, of so, shit. I mean, from me being an outside point of view, it feels like this guy was actually being genuine. Nah. No. No. no, he's a scam he artist. He's a fucking scam artist. I'm talking about at the beginning. At the beginning. Maybe at the beginning, yeah. But then, like, I feel like he got nervous because he thought, like, his whole shit was going to be taken. And that's when he wanted to be like, yo, fuck you guys. I'm out. Peace and take this, take this shit. Right? Like, that's what I feel like would happen. Because, like, I feel like if that job would have went, like, just normal, like, just got it, like, let him open it and then see what was in it and split it. I guarantee it would have went that way. But I feel like he genuinely got, he got scared. I mean, listen, Vinny, I called the dude today on the phone to ask him for the, to basically pay. I was going to just chop it up with him and be like, hey, listen, bro, whatever happened, happened. Just give me the money back for the chips that we wasted and we'll be good. All right, whatever. Mm -hmm. You a fucking slime ball. He didn't answer my phone. So I thought, okay, maybe the dude's not awake. So then I'm driving around and I see his ass at Legion on the bike. I pull right next up to him. Before I can even get a word out, I'm about to start talking to him. The dude sees me in the driver's seat. Instantly drives away, starts doing wheelies, and just dips the fuck out as fast as he can. And then I caught him while he's running, and he just hung up on me. And he just drove plain, away. Plain and simple, that dude is just like not not trustworthy right. whatsoever. He's chilling with fucking me and Rami called Buddha. it from the start. That's how it is. Me and Rami called it from the start. That the, the tension when me and Rami showed up, the animosity, the, the, the something was in the air. Me and Rami both said it to each other. We're like, uh -huh. me and Rami mm. both said it. Me, listen, me and Rami is scam. We've been scam. I, I knew, I knew the guy was doing it because I would have done the exact same fucking thing he did. I would have took that crate and I would have fucking dipped. So, I mean, I can't. I but can't, see, I can't understand like why ruin your. See, would. the thing, the thing that I, I can't put together is like why ruin the relationship that he has with Tugs but, for but so come. long. For something so no, no, I don't know him that well. Oh, I, thought, I know like, you about did, his life. I thought you did a lot with no. him in the sewers. That's why. No, no, yeah, no. See, bro, I told you, Tuggy. This is someone. It told me what, motherfucker, no, that no, you guys no, don't know. No, no, I don't mean it in a bad way. I mean, like, people think that you and him were cool. I don't know why. Yeah, because mother... Okay, because some of y'all, like, we all do... It. No, bitches, like, because some of y'all, like, <laughs> make up your own mind. Like, listen, well, I, listen, I love you guys, but sometimes y'all, like, back. jump to stupid <laughs> conclusions sometimes. Like, yo, this guy gave me a phone call. They must be best friends. Nah, dude, I fucking hold this guy up <laughs> the in the sewers all the time. You, the way you said it was like, oh, yeah, this, nah, this guy wouldn't do that. I know this guy. You were defending him all day. Yeah, I, that's because you're stupid, bro. What you want me to say, Dad? It's not defending. I listen, you defended listen, a guy there's that no you, need for name calling. Said, oh, let's, I don't know. Let's let's some guy, with that. Okay, <laughs> let, let, let's listen. Let, let, let's use a little bit of common sense. Someone give me a phone call. They looking for people if free guns. Why the fuck we ain't going to take that? That don't mean you're, they're your friend. It's an opportunity, dude. Oh, you vouched for him like he was like, you, you were, you were nonstop. Where, like, you like, where, what you, not listen, like I said, just because you like, you know, Kind of thick skull don't mean that's what happened. I'm bro. fixed, bro. Everybody said the exact same thing. I'm saying, yeah, because y'all, but listen, why are you arguing about? Oh, hold on, like, hold on. Let, let, let me chime in. Hold on, let me chime in. Yes. Was it hold on? Hold on. You were saying, oh, we don't believe him. Hold on. Was it Tugs <laughs> vouching for him or <laughs> Tugs looking at the bigger picture of things and trying to figure shit out? Exactly. To the me, whole time. No, dumb fuck. Uh, I looked at it like <laughs> this stop is a, the free right, give me a, give me a stop, 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 free, stop doing that shit. I'm not, I'm not a bum and you won't be calling me that. Oh, let's, let's stop doing that now. All right? That's all it was. I don't know where this like, where this like, <laughs> the, here, here's a problem, right? And this is why I'm calling it dumb fuck. The, from the very start of all this, it's a contract. I'm getting it for the crew, right? So when this, all this shit go down and you making it sound like, yo, this guy's like this guy best friend and shit like that when i'm just trying to figure out what the fuck happened like you put in me in the same bucket as the guy that fucked you so that's no, gonna make me say putting you in the same in the same bucket no one's doing that no one's blaming you we're just saying the way you made it like rom even said it like you were defending the guy yeah but we you were guys all under could, the impression yeah, but, you knew him well at the end I, what did, okay, can you explain exactly you what I like, said oh. that made it seem now? You were like, you were like oh, I've got this contract with this guy. Like, yeah, we got a, a contract, couple of, bro. Wait, wait, wait. What let you me mean a free gun? I let you, right? I got the conversation. I know where his HQ is. Like, this guy wouldn't. And then when he scammed us, and me and Rami go, nah, he scammed us. You went, 
nah nah man he wouldn't do that to us like i know this guy he wouldn't scam us rami you gotta listen to me like no nah, that's not that wouldn't no, happen i don't think he said he wouldn't i came the whole from time. the same perspective uh, that Vinny just did the is taco had the same one I too know the guy is that it's fucking suicide dude so how'd it go wrong because i'm looking at it like so the, we lost out of all the groups he could have chose why do you hurt for cg exactly dude i can't help like you know <laughs> like you know i don't know what to tell you like okay you felt a certain way but at the same time you got to hear people out you know what i mean i think it was more like it, it, i don't think it's more like not that he wouldn't do it it's more like why would he do that is what the boys were saying like tell you exactly like, like why, why would he do the, that yeah that's what but yesterday you it's just the way you were saying it yesterday that's why me and rami were like well, yeah maybe it was coming. just the word yeah maybe like, it was just the like, wording but i'm I, gonna be real I, mean, I understand both sides if if you if here's the thing though right like if you think it's like that you can ask you know what i mean like do you, is this your boy do you know this guy you know what i mean but like to walk away and be like, "Yo, I'm coming up with the conclusions because I think this is what he's saying." It, who the fuck is this? Crazy. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, oh, I didn't see his braids. <laughs> I didn't see his braids. I'm sorry. What's up, Zozo? You, you only know Zozo, Zozo, Zozo baby. Well, that's crazy. What's, What's up, boys? Listen, I, 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 I think I think we're I think we're like going too much. This guy's a piece of shit, listen, plain and simple. Listen, at the end of the day, it is what it is, right? It happened. Uh, I mean, just uh, did you deal with him? Did you get rid of him? Like. We saw him on a bike, and then Peanut started calling him, and he took off. We couldn't catch up to him. This dude's gonna avoid. Oh, wait, listen, wait, wait, we we already know the dude's a rat. Okay, I wasn't trying to even go after him or kill him or do something. I was just gonna talk to him, and be like, "Hey, listen, bro, you did some slimy shit. Fuck you. We're not gonna do shit with you again. But we need that money back for those fucking HQ chips." Listen, that at the end of the buy. day, what did it really cost you? It cost you a little like bit 6, of your 000. time and fucking six grand. I mean, bro, it's really not that fucking. Oh, we serious. definitely gonna get that back. Oh, like, get, get, I mean, listen, get the money back. It is what it is. But listen, yeah, it's not that's that what I'm fucking. Literally, if you're worried about losing fucking an hour of your time over the over the slimy fuck. Like, well, why keep fucking dealing with it? Just move on from it. You uh, yeah, yeah. I mean? we just I just want the money back. I mean, we just want the get money back. Get the money back, back and call it a fucking day. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, that's fine with me. I think Rami was over it too, to be honest. But yeah, I don't, I don't think we should. Uh, if any of you ever did fuck with that guy, don't don't fuck with that dude again, bro. We don't like that dude's a slime ball. Now he's fucked. Fuck him. Imagine if we had this meeting while pushing. I didn't really understand a little bit of money on this. Uh, yo, hey, Vinny, uh, it's about to be a storm. So no, I'm, I'm, Chris. I'm gonna sign us in. Go sign on <laughs> in. Yeah, yeah. We should All get right. a meeting spot down and get a bench on there. Just fucking yeah, right. Just start passing it off. Yeah. yeah, peanut sign in now because I think like in another minute it won't. It'll like act like you didn't sign in. Okay, yes, OG.